bad, burns my eyes. This is bad. It's a no-no. So, I found this at my Walmart recently for $40. And I thought, it's $40. What could go wrong? Um, so, we're going to unbox it and we'll see. Okay. So, on the back here, it says, hold steady, locking knob, fully adjustable ball head mount, rigid exterior metal casing. Rigid exterior metal casing. So good, they had to say it twice. <laughs> so, light, total LEDs, 120, 60 watt max, specification 6.56 foot cable. That's two meters, guys. Light dimensions 9.05 inches by 7.48 by 1.97 inches. Ugh. Okay, includes studio light, adjustable ball head mount, locking knob. Um, warning, Prop 65. In California, everything causes cancer. Uh, so the Bluetooth word mark and logos are registered, blah, 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 blah. On the side, they've got their name and this nice color array their name again the other direction some sort of barcode things something on the back and it tastes like a box sack okay so let's open it up unnecessary knifing five minutes okay What do we got? What do we got? It's a flap. Some styrofoam that isn't styrofoam. This is like the styrofoam alternative. I don't know. This must be the locking ball head. Full admission, I watched another YouTube video before buying this light. Um, and I never would have known that this works the way that it does, which you'll see in a minute here. Okay. That is it in the box. Oh! Empty box! So inside we've got bubble wrap, styrofoam, ball head thingamabob, the light itself and this handy dandy guide says install the app do this and then do these things and then do some more stuff and pushing buttons that's a lot of button pushing a bunch of words i'm not gonna read in a one year wait did that say a one year warranty a one year warranty not super impressive to look at I don't know why all this space is wasted down here. Um, not necessarily for a heat sink. It looks like they've got a metal heat sink on the inside and then they've got these fins for heat sink as well. So here's the weirdness about this ball mount. You have to unscrew this top part, put it through this hole and then screw it back in. I'm gonna flip it around though, cause that just seems sensible. Doesn't it? To have the pads on the inside instead of one pad on the outside. Here we go. Oh, and just like that, we have an adjustable ball head thingamabob. So you would just put this on your tripod. Okay. So not the best tripod in the world, but not the probably not the best light in the world. I don't know yet. I haven't turned it on. This thing might surprise me. It might be like, holy crap, for 40 bucks, you can have this amazing light. A boom. Uh, I mean, that's pretty cool, I guess, if you're into that sort of stuff. Uh, let's plug it in and see what it does. Now, I'm, I'm also not seeing any controls. There are no buttons on this whatsoever. No buttons. 
button, here button, there button. No buttons. There are no buttons. No buttons. None to be seen. So what that tells me is that you absolutely positively have to download the app. And they've got the little scanner bob there. We need an extension cord. Extended. Extension. Here we go. Oh, oh, no, we've done that. Do, do, do. Oh, and suddenly I'm red, and then I'm green, and now I'm blue. Ah, it burns my eyes. Okay. Jeez. I mean, it's doing something. That's better than nothing, I guess. So it looks like I'm connected. So now there's a couple options here. White light, which I mean, that looks like it's doing different Kelvin here, but it would be really handy if it actually said what Kelvin this is. I don't see that as being super useful without that. Although this is pretty bright guys. This is, I mean, for setting on the desk like that, I feel a little bit more well lit than I was before. This is how I was lit before, but I mean, I can change that. I just tend to like a more dark lighting. Of course it does have a dimness here. It looks like it's doing some flicker. You guys see that flicker? The closer I get, the more flicker I get. So right away, this is a no-no for video lights. If they're claiming that this is a video light, which they're saying it's a full spectrum, full color LED studio light. Oh, what kind of studio are they talking about? Most likely a video studio, but this is bad. It's doing it through all the different settings of white. The more I dim it, the worse it gets. Even at 100%, you can still see it. You see all this, this disturbance up here? It's a no-no. I can appreciate the brightness of this light. Look how bad that is. Here's pink, here's red, the yellow. This is green, the teal into blue, pinkish, blue, purple. There's a saturation adjustment. So that's 100%, that's 0% saturation. It's pretty good color. So here's what I'll say, guys. I appreciate the app, it's pretty nice. Like I said, I wish they had the Kelvin on this. I appreciate how bright it is, but it's not very far away from me. This is how far away it is, but it's just sitting on my desk. Um, so just out of shot, it works pretty good for a light. I would never use this for video though, just because of all of that flicker. So I do appreciate the colors. I like the app-ish, but this is not a video light. So sorry, Vivitar, I would say it is probably not a buy if you're looking for a video light. If you're just looking for some cool colored lights in your room, then it's a buy for that. I'm probably gonna throw him on Boba Fett back here. Now that I like. Boba Fett, you just stay right there. As you wish. That day she was amazed to discover that when he was saying as you wish, what he meant was, I love you. Aw, I love you too. So yeah guys, I'd say for 40 bucks, not a video light. I can't really tell that it's flickering from here back there. So I guess you could use it like I'm using it to light up something in the background. You're probably still getting flicker. A buy for decorating your room, sure. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button. If you'd like to see more videos by me, hit the subscribe button. And if you have any comments, please leave a comment down below and I will try to get to them. Uh, so yeah, that's it for now. I appreciate you guys watching. Have a good one. I'm gonna play with the colors on Boba Fett.